Okay. Assalamu alaikum. Today I'm going to show you how to fix your MacBook Pro application 2010, 2011, and 2012. Okay, some of the graphic faults you can see too many lines. See? Yeah. Okay. And some of the MacBook only load, load the app on and half. Then it stop. Stop loading again. And some of the MacBook will turn to the blue screen and some of them white screen. So it's all the graphic fall. But in my case, as you can see, okay, turn on again. As you can see. Ah, this in my case this this happened to me and how today I'm going to show you how to fix this graphic fold in your MacBook okay okay um, I make this video short enough because my internet is not good to upload big big amount of gigabytes so remove this one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven eleven connector see and remove this one screw from this fan but after you remove all the screw and all the connector you can take out this motherboard okay this is the motherboard I put aside this first okay now what we're going to do we're going to open this heat sink okay open this heat sink Now you have two options. Whether you want to go into reflow this graphic chip to use this chip again, or remove this MOSFET and the coil to remove permanently. But if you using this remove the coil and the MOSFET for for this uh, graphic chip, you cannot use this anymore. So you have only you have option to use the Intel from this i5 or i7 CPU. So if you want to use this graphic SD AMD SD again, then we have to reflow. Okay, but now I'm not going to remove permanently permanent this chip because I want to use this again. Then what we have to do, we need this looks and you have we need hot egg gun okay all right so i'm going to clean this thermal face first okay this is the amd okay then we're going to reflow how we going to reflow is easy. Okay. Then we just put this thermal, not the so sorry. We just put this pass around the graphic chip. Okay. And put on this small amount in the middle, but don't don't hit on the middle and only the side like this so so 
So I'm using it under 480 degree. Okay. Make sure the flux going under the chip. Okay. Then if you already see all the flux going under the chip, then we can start to reflow. We can start to hit this chip. Okay. The reason why I put on the middle because I don't want to hit too much on the silicon chip. Because if you put hit too much on the silicon chip it will be broken crack so i put just a little bit of flux on the middle so it help the silicone not taking too much heat okay Don't forget to subscribe my channel because we upload every day or every week about how to repair a laptop or MacBook. So together we learning how to fix a MacBook or a, or a laptop. We make tutorials for you, for you guys. If you're interested with a repair, okay, I think it's enough, right? Okay, what I'm going to do now, okay. We wait until this chip cool. cool. Remember, once you open the heatsink, you need to put a new thermal vest. Okay. Otherwise, your CPU and your GPU will hot again, become hot, and it will shut down after a few minutes if you don't put a new thermal vest on your uh, GPU and CPU. Okay, I'm using the Arctic Silver Thermal Paste. Clean this too. Okay. I'm going to put it in. Okay. 
why you why this happen okay i will tell you why this happen it because the thermal paste someone buy this from 2010 never change never change the thermal paste then the thermal paste become hard and it's not not function then the gpu become hot and hot and, and hot and it's become faulty okay make sure if you buy a new or a second hand if you buy a new laptop probably you need around one year then you replace the thermal paste if you buy the second hand laptop or macbook you must change this thermal paste otherwise the laptop become hot and it will be just problem later okay We're not going to put all of this connector because we want to try uh, the graphic has been fixed or not because sometimes they need reflow a little bit longer okay it's not really important all right Put few screw only to here. Make it faster. Come on. Back. Put this back and Let's try this again. Okay. 
now you can see there is no uh, like before okay when I do like this it's nothing see okay this is how you fix your graphic issue not only on macbook you can do this on all kind of laptop yep, as long as it has graphic on it see okay see there is nothing like before okay so thanks for watching guys then don't forget to subscribe to my new video because i'm going to repair many see thanks